I wasn't alone. Last night, Ardra cried herself to sleep. Tonight, no one cried in bed because he kept us in the pool until the sun came up. To beat the Thai girls, we knew we had to get into their heads, learn how they fight. And the best way to do that was to see a fight. We asked Master Toddy to take us to a real fight. He said no problem and took us to where they fight all day. See, in a cockfight, there's no referee, no judges, no rematch. One on one, face to face, a fight to the death. In the fight game, no matter who you are, your next fight could always be your last. So you better be ready. We knew about Master Toddy's secrets. We were wondering what secrets his brother had in store for us. It was the toughest workout of the trip, and the best. Our punches, our kicks, our balance, everything felt great. It was the day before the fight, everything was clicking. But for me, I don't know, something was still missing. Images of the fight kept me up that night. I cried. He called. I have something for you. When I was young, my master gave it to me. To protect me. Now it will protect you. You will win a fight.
Red sky at night, sailor's delight. Red sky morning, sailor's warning. It was morning. It was here. Fight day. There she was, a Thai boxer from birth. Been in my head for two months. In eight hours, we'd be in the ring. On fight day, you just want to get in the ring. Feel the canvas under your feet. Take it all in, breathe the air. For the first time since we had arrived, the hot sun was nowhere in sight. It was pouring, but it didn't matter. They'd come from the countryside and the cities, thousands all to see us fight. And if they weren't here, they were watching. It was time, kill or be killed. Lisa! 